What's up, you chain token holders, money makers, and Polygon token holders? Let's talk about what's going on with VeChain, Polygon, and definitely with Bitcoin. Let's take a look right now. VAT token VET is at 0.078. Take a look. The entire crypto market is almost uh, stable right now. We're up 0.32% with the market cap of 2.08 trillion, and we started seeing some of the spark into the market, but the fear and greed index right now still is at 21 extreme fear last month as you see 23 extreme fear last week 23 extreme fear yesterday 23 and today we are also in extreme fear with the score of 21 the index is 21 what i'm trying to get at is the market is super super fearful we do not really know what next week brings us right now we are in the long weekend in the united states with the martin luther king holiday coming up on monday what i'm trying to share here is how vchain has been trading what is one catalyst that you really want to think about when it comes to vchain and definitely for polygon matic token holder we talked about polygon as well it's definitely a, one of my great play for 2022 that i'm hopeful for right now we are at two dollars and 32 cents we precisely talked about polygon when it went at the bottom level up below two dollars one dollar and 92 cents prior to that we bought polygon at one dollar and 50 cent right here and then we got the gain all the way up to two dollars and 92 cents right now i'm going to talk about both vchain polygon and how it relates to bitcoin take a look bitcoin right now is 43,000 and change the volume is pretty stable or at least uh, somewhere around the 17 billion that we usually see dollars to 2.75 percent down but if you take a look at seven day this is the chart it looks like we saw the bottom we started getting back up we created higher highs and higher lows as you can see we hit all the way up to forty four thousand and four hundred dollars we got back down and we are trying to consolidate so this is a seven day chart so you remember let's go back to which and take a look at the seven day so if you take a look at seven day we went down we saw the bottom as well we saw the valley we started getting back up we are trying to consolidate so pretty usual chart that you see for so this is your v chain chart for seven days this is your bitcoin chart for seven days so what i'm trying to get at is we chain follows bitcoin let's take a look at polygon how it has been trading for last seven days take a look so we are at down and we started getting back up and we are trying to consolidate this is polygon at two dollars and 32 cents so this is a polygon chart and this is a bitcoin chart this is a bitcoin chart and this is the polygon matic token chart what i'm trying to get at is we chain had a pretty rough year enter last year take a look last one year if you take a look we saw the high of 28 cents or 26 cents 2546 and we saw that we got back down to five cents we got back up and in my opinion this is still a very discounted price for which and it is going to get traction this year this year i'm going to share precisely why we'll get traction this year there are totally a lot of catalysts coming up but the analysts are also talking about vchain i wanted to leave you with this article by the way if you haven't subscribed to the channel i want to ask you hit that subscribe button that helps out the channel we are almost at fifteen thousand subscribers and i would love to get your help so subscribe to the channel hit the like button doesn't really cost you anything but we can share this video with more and more people i put a ton of effort energy and time into building this video sharing this information back to the community with all of you so your love will really be helpful take a look wet token price to hit 40 cents by the end of 2022 now analyst says a couple of popular analysts have been talking about weechain but this particular popular analyst said that it is going to hit 40 cents in my opinion that's a pretty conservative estimate for weechain yes we're we're sideways last year but this year brings fresh new money it brings a ton of initiatives they launch vusd the stable coin they are partnering up with walmart even 
proven stronger. They have been proven the, the cases, the use cases, the business cases. They are solving the real world problem. This is not based on hype. I love uh, Dogecoin. I love Shiba Inu, but they're based on community and hype. This is based on a solid use case, solid business case. It has been solving for many lucrative industry standards. One is the retail industry I've seen for Walmart. The second one is they have partnered with MasterCard in the Australia and the Asian region. The third one you can think of is IoT, the Internet of Things that can identify unique transaction, put a number around it, and then get some of the lucrative data in terms of big data and data mining. So you want to keep that in mind. Since the beginning of this year, let's take a look at what this analyst is talking about. Since the beginning of this year, WeChain has been a significant downward trend and the drop has been in line with the general trend in cryptocurrency market. And that's why I have been tracking Bitcoin and VeChain pretty closely the way it has been moving. So in my mind, what I'm thinking is if Bitcoin hits $60,000 once again, we can expect that VeChain, VAT token will be hitting almost all time high. Now at that point, we will be three to four times return on the investment. So if you think about seven cents and compared with all time high, that is going to be 25 cents. It's more than 3x, 3.5x um, ramp up on the wet token price point. So you want to keep that in mind. The decline appeared to be reaching at its end of uh, one time, but significant price rise have begun to emerge. VeChain currently trades at 8 7 to 8 cents rather, indicating that the bulls have returned. The bears have seized the control and the nearest support level is 7875. As you see right now on VeChain, we are at 786, more on the bullish side and we can cross the 10 12. So 10 cents and 12 cents, 10 cents 0 0.1012. So if we cross that price point, there will be 13 to 14 cents on the horizon, as you already know. I was referring to this particular price point, 01016 or 01012 could be the magic price point that you want to look into because that has shown a great, great resistance just back in the days. And since then, we fall back, we fell back down to 8 cents followed by seven cents, followed by six cents. We went to the six regions. I was not able to buy, but I hope you bought it and congratulations. We got back up pretty quickly. I shared a video at that point as well. So by the way, do your due diligence. I'm not saying buy to sell. This is only for the entertainment purposes. And if you haven't clicked the like button, do that, subscribe. Your help is very much appreciated. Let's get back to this article and this analyst. We change surge price multiple times beyond its present level. One enterprise focused altcoin may be appearing, approaching a price zone that could allow for an effective entrance according to the popular crypto trade Michael Van de Poppy. Now, VeChain is looking at some enormous prospect and we have seen a couple of them. We have, we have also seen them getting into the metaverse world as well. And VeChain is cryptocurrency and blockchain platform designed to aid businesses in optimizing their supply networks. We have seen that supply chain management became one of the challenge for the businesses, retailers, uh, and many other industry as well. If VeChain can solve the problem for one industry, which is one of the most challenging industry if you think about retail, it is going to ch challenge and it is going to change and give a business solution for more than one industry and many of or most of the industries rather. Well, VAT is looking at some massive opportunity with the USDT pair here, higher time frame support underneath or beneath a trigger, but also flipping 7.5 is a trigger. Now, after it flips this 7.5 range, we are right now at 7.8, but it did not really flip that range. If we flip that range, we can go all the way up to 0 0.012 1012 or 1011 that is 10 cents and above if we cross that line i do believe that based on the chart what we have seen in the past we can see 14 cents for we chain pretty pretty quickly so keep that in mind on monday the analyst mentioned that 0.075 would trigger as it will work as a trigger by the way and with that particular trigger we may see that can go to the 35th rank cryptocurrency by market cap that already surpassed that level. 
The analysts are also talking about only one who has recently been positive on VeChain, which is this particular analyst, and VAP might surge multiple times beyond its present price, according to the crypto analyst. As long as it stays over six cents, the analyst is bullish for VAT, and also if we get about 10 cents, precisely what I mentioned, and that is 0 0.1030. So 10 and a half cent range, we'll see 12 cents followed by 14 and 15 cents and beyond. If VAT takes off this year, probably we will see 38 to 40 cents, which is a massive whooping return for VeChain holders. We have been seeing there is something definitely happening for VeChain every single week, and I'm super bullish about their recent announcement for VUSD, the VeChain Store's first stablecoin enabling Web3, which is one of the newer and innovative stuff that you have started hearing into the technology and innovation and a ton of other DeFi, sustainability objectives, and much, much more. If you think about VeChain with the release of VUSD, and if you're not really sure what stablecoin can do, I just wanted to quickly present that over to you that a stablecoin is a class cryptocurrency that attempts to offer price stability that are backed by reserve assets. Now, why this is important because it gets the best of the both worlds in terms of the instant processing and security privacy payment over the cryptocurrencies. At the same time, it's not as volatile as the cryptocurrency itself. So VUSD is expected not to be a super, super volatile as the VAT token. VAT token itself is not super volatile in my opinion compared to some other cryptocurrencies out in the market. If you think about Dogecoin, Shiba Inu and many other cryptocurrencies that fluctuates super, super well, we have not seen VAT token goes 2, 3, 4x and then drops back 2, 3, 4x as well. So that's the beauty of VeChain and that's why I like VAT token a ton more. But with the stable coin, their cryptocurrencies, their attempt to peg their market value at some external references, they're backed by some reserves. And stable coin may be pegged to a cryptocurrency like US or not cryptocurrency, currencies, fiat currencies like US dollar to a commodities price such as gold. Now, stablecoin achieve their price stability via collateralization or backing that I just mentioned or through the algorithmic mechanism, buying and selling. That is the reference asset for the derivatives and that is going to add a ton more value in that token. Guys, I hope you like this video. Take a look as well into Polygon. We are at $2.32. I'm super bullish on Polygon as well. Quickly look into it. We see that it's down 1.86%. Our volume is also down 15.73%, but that's where the opportunity kicks in. Polygon is supposed to hit once again, very close to $3 levels. We will see that in, uh, in nearer future, as soon as the crypto market rebounds. And that's the sign of getting into newer price point for Polygon, WeChain, Bitcoin, and the entire cryptocurrency market. I hope you like this video. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. I will see you in the next video.